The time to awaken has arrived. If you believe December is just another ordinary month on the calendar, it's time to reconsider. This period brings with it mysteries and opportunities that can completely transform how the year ends. The chaos of November is finally behind us. A whirlwind of intense emotions, unforeseen events, and twists that, for many, was exhausting. But now, as we step into December, something significant happens. The energy shifts. This isn't just the last month of the year. It's the closing of a cycle. The moment when everything can either align or fall apart completely. December is the final stretch. The point where consciously made choices can define what lies ahead. It's like a portal of possibilities opening before you, inviting you to reflect on what truly matters and how you wish to conclude what you've started. This fortnight, in particular, is crucial. It's the starting point to adjust your trajectory and shape the year's ending with purpose and clarity. This isn't just another ordinary week. It's an invitation from the universe for you to take the reins of your story and make every remaining day of 2024 count. After all, what do you wish to leave behind? What do you want to carry forward into the next chapter of your life? December is not about dwelling on what was lost, but about recognizing what can still be achieved. And you, who have made it this far, were chosen to receive this message. Take advantage of this unique moment to reassess your priorities, align your intentions, and begin now to build a year-end that truly makes sense. If this message resonated with you, keep following along and show your support by liking the channel. That way, more chosen ones can receive this important message, and together, we can achieve an extraordinary end to the year. Chosen One you are standing at a crucial juncture. Every decision made in this first half of December will have consequences far beyond what you can imagine. This is not just the conclusion of 2024, but a profound preparation, spiritual and energetic, for what lies ahead. As Ecclesiastes 3.1 teaches us, To everything there is a season, and a time for every purpose under heaven. This is the moment to align yourself with the purpose you wish to manifest in your life. December is not merely the last chapter of a year coming to an end. It is the beginning of what 2025 will be. Picture this period as fertile ground, where every choice you make is a seed being planted for the future. The universe is asking you, how do you wish to close this cycle? The energy surrounding you at this moment is unique, a carefully orchestrated opportunity. It is like a divine reminder that the time to act is not tomorrow but now. The challenges faced over the past 11 months may have been heavy, but do not let them dictate how you finish this year. In Philippians 3.13-14, we are encouraged. Forgetting what is behind and straining toward what is ahead, I press on toward the goal. This passage invites you to leave the weight of the past behind and focus on what is yet to come. Now is the time to rise, to let go of what no longer serves, and to move forward toward what God and the universe have prepared for you. This fortnight does not demand perfection. It demands reconnection. It's about finding what truly matters to you adjusting your priorities, and starting to plant the right seeds for a prosperous future. Your actions during this period will not only shape the end of 2024, but will also have a lasting impact on the coming year and everything you wish to achieve. What you do now will resonate far beyond this moment. Think of this as a direct calling. This is your moment to reflect, adjust, and act. Ask yourself, what truly matters? What steps do I need to take now? It doesn't have to be grand or perfect, but it must be real and aligned with your purpose. God has already prepared the way for you, but it's up to you to take the first step and walk this path. This is the time to embrace the opportunities before you. 
even if they seem small or challenging. Remember that every action counts. A small step today can turn into a giant leap tomorrow. Do not underestimate the power of starting. Chosen one, time is on your side, but you must use it wisely. Chosen one, you are experiencing a unique fortnight, and there is more happening around you than meets the eye. In this first half of December, the veil between worlds, the barrier separating the physical from the spiritual, is thinner than at other times of the year. This phenomenon occurs during periods of transition, as we close one cycle and prepare for the next. December, the final month of 2024, is one of these powerful moments. This is not just any period. It is the final chapter of a year, brimming with potential to resolve unfinished matters and plant seeds for the future. During these times, spiritual energies are believed to become more intense and accessible. This veil acts as a subtle boundary between the visible world and the invisible realms, where energies, messages, and inspirations flow more freely. When the veil is thinner, our intuition sharpens, and we are more likely to notice signs, feel unexplainable connections, and even experience phenomena that seem supernatural. The new moon that opened December and the upcoming meteor shower are more than mere astronomical events. They function as catalysts, opening portals for spiritual visitors to draw near. These visitors may include ancestors, guides, or energies linked to transformation and growth. Have you recently felt as though you were being watched? Had dreams that seemed to carry messages or experienced sudden emotions without explanation? These are signs that something greater is trying to communicate with you. Why is this happening now? Because December is not just a month of closure. It is a time of reckoning, a moment for deep reflection. It is as though the universe is inviting us to review the year that has passed and prepare for what lies ahead. The spirits and energies that approach during this period do not come to incite fear, but to guide. They are subtle reminders that there is something greater at play, something that deserves your attention. These energies may manifest as a sudden idea, an unusual coincidence, or even an internal feeling urging you to take action. The concept of the veil between worlds can also be understood as a metaphor for our own perception. When we are more receptive, whether through meditation, prayer, or reflection, we can capture the messages that typically go unnoticed amidst the noise of daily life. This is an ideal time to listen to your intuition. You might be wondering, what do I do with this? The answer is simple. Pay attention to the signs, reflect on what truly matters, and allow yourself to connect with what lies beyond the obvious. This month's configuration is particularly special. It began with a new moon, symbolizing new beginnings, and will end with another new moon, a rare and significant occurrence. Two new moons framing December deliver a clear message. The universe is offering an opportunity for renewal and cycle closure. The first moon invites us to plant seeds, to think about what we want for the future. The second, on December 30th, will be the moment to revisit those intentions, adjust them, and consolidate the lessons learned before the year ends. Chosen one, take advantage of this moment to realign your life. Ask yourself, what do I still need to resolve? What steps can I take now to begin a new cycle with strength and clarity? Use the energy of this fortnight to reflect, act, and connect with what truly matters. If this message resonated with you, like and share it so that more Chosen Ones can hear it and prepare for this powerful moment. Together, we can make this transition a time of real and meaningful transformation. Chosen One, this new moon is a powerful invitation for you to plant the seeds of the future you desire. It is a moment of reflection and decision, 
an opportunity to visualize the changes you want to implement as we approach a new year. But here's the secret. It is not enough to dream or make wishes. Action is required. The second new moon, arriving on December 30th, will be the time for evaluation. Have you fulfilled the commitments you made to yourself? Have you followed the steps you planned? It is as if the universe is offering you a second chance to adjust whatever is necessary before 2024 comes to an end. This period is not just about astrological phenomena or symbolism. It's about how you align your energy with the opportunities the universe presents. This fortnight, initiated by the new moon, is the foundation of the month. You cannot ignore its importance and expect everything to resolve itself at the end. Think of the two new moons as spiritual pillars supporting December. They bring themes of closure and new beginnings, inviting you to reflect. What am I ready to leave behind and what do I want to carry forward? The meteor shower occurring during this fortnight is more than a spectacle in the sky. Each streak of light is a message, a reminder that the universe is in motion and that you must be too. Picture yourself under the starry sky, watching these rays of light pierce through the darkness. For many, they are just meteors. For you, chosen one, they are cosmic signs, driving your transformation. Tomorrow, the meteor shower reaches its peak. This event is more than coincidental. It amplifies the energy of the new moon, bringing forth thoughts and feelings you may have been ignoring. Use this moment to align with your deepest desires and step into the next cycle with clarity and purpose. The meteors crossing the sky this week are much more than celestial events. For many, they are just fleeting lights that disappear as quickly as they appear. But for those who watch closely, these bright trails are messages from the universe, a reminder that time is precious and opportunities do not wait. Imagine yourself under the starry sky, contemplating these meteors cutting through the darkness. Something within you stirs, and a wish arises spontaneously. Why? Because deep down, we know these phenomena represent more than just a visual spectacle. They carry profound symbolism. They are invitations to act, to transform desires into reality before inertia erases them. These meteors do not offer clear answers. They do not solve problems but open doors. They are invitations to pause, reflect, and listen to what your soul has to say. How many times have you ignored these messages because you were too busy, trapped in routine, or distracted by superficial concerns. This meteor shower, aligned with the energy of the new moon, is a rare opportunity to reconnect with your purpose. It is a reminder that just as meteors shine briefly, our chances for change are also fleeting. The Bible teaches us in Ephesians 5.16, making the most of every opportunity, because the days are evil. This passage invites us to value time and use it wisely. Meteors are like this word, a sign that time is passing, but you have the chance to act. If we do not seize the moments when the universe calls us to action, they may vanish forever. Just as luminous trails disappear in the sky, lost opportunities become mere memories of what could have been. There is no need for perfection. You don't need to have all the answers or a flawless plan. The universe does not reward those who wait for ideal conditions. It rewards those who move. This week is a moment of unique alignment, a favorable time to plant the seeds of the future you desire. It could be the beginning of a new habit, a project you've been postponing, or even a conversation that needs to happen. This is your green light, your moment to take the first step. If you let this week pass without action, you will lose more than just days on the calendar. You will lose the opportunity to create a lasting impact, to set the tone not just for December, but for the entire next year. It's not about achieving everything at once or reaching grand goals in a few days. What matters most is to start 
even if the initial step is small. By taking that step, you allow the energy of this moment to propel you forward. Think of the meteors as metaphors for your own journey. They shine intensely for a brief moment, leaving a lasting impact. Similarly, your decision to act now can be the catalyst for significant changes in your life. Don't let doubts or hesitation keep you from seizing this opportunity. Chosen One, this is your chance to shine. Use the light of the meteors as inspiration to illuminate your path. Don't wait for the perfect moment. It will never come. Create the moment with your actions and intentions. Plant your seeds under the energy of this new moon, knowing that each small gesture has the potential to transform your future. Let your light leave a mark on the sky of your own story and inspire others to do the same. After all, time is precious and the universe is waiting for you to take the first step. Chosen One, it's time to deeply reflect on what you've been putting off. What is that action, that step, you always delay, waiting for the right moment? Let me tell you, the right moment is now. The energies are aligned, the path is open, and this week is the opportunity the universe is offering for you to move forward. Don't let the frantic pace of December carry you away on autopilot, as it does for most people. This month may seem harmless, suggesting there's plenty of time, but that's the trap. December is not a calm road leading to January. It's a countdown. The first week of December marks the start of this timer. As holiday decorations go up and to-do lists pile high, it's easy to get lost in distractions. The problem is, this busyness is not always aligned with your true goals. Have you stopped to ask yourself if the energy you're dedicating to your daily activities is actually taking you where you want to go? Think carefully. What you choose to prioritize now doesn't just set the tone for the rest of the month. It can shape the entire next year. Have you ever felt like December flew by in the blink of an eye? One moment you believe there's plenty of time, and the next, it's New Year's Eve, and you're left asking, why didn't I start earlier? It doesn't have to be this way. This week is your call to action. Pause. Reflect. What is consuming your focus and pulling you away from your goals? What is the one thing you can start today to create momentum and transform the rest of the year? The universe doesn't demand perfection. It doesn't expect you to have all the answers or plan every detail. It only asks that you begin. Even if the first step is small, even if it feels uncertain, the most important thing is action. The perfect moment? It's an illusion. It is created the instant you decide to act. Think of the opportunities you've let slip by believing there would be a more convenient time. This new moon, right now, is your reminder that time is fleeting, but actions taken with purpose have lasting impact. It's a call to step out of your comfort zone and claim what is yours. This energy will not wait. It demands movement. Don't see this week as just another ordinary stretch of the calendar. View it as a window to align your desires with your actions. This is the time to leave behind doubts and excuses and take the first step toward what you know is meant for you. Don't let this opportunity pass you by. Chosen one, the time is now. Wishing is not enough, it's time to act. Now that is why it's time to face a simple yet powerful truth. The perfect moment will never exist on its own. It does not arrive as something magical or idealized. The perfect moment is created the very instant you decide to act. This new moon, the 1st of December, is the blank page the universe is offering you. And now, it places the pen in your hand to begin writing your story. The question is, what will you do with this opportunity? Will you take time to reflect on your true desires? Or will you allow the hustle and bustle of daily life to suffocate your clarity and purpose? It is not enough to simply set intentions. 
Intentions are the beginning, but they must be accompanied by concrete actions. Committing to your goals means taking a step, even if it's small, even if it seems insignificant. Choose something you've been putting off, something you know you can change, and take the initiative right now. It doesn't have to be grand or perfect. Call it your lunar move. A small gesture, yet filled with meaning and intention. Why does this matter so much? Because this new moon is not just another celestial event. It is the first new moon of a month, laden with profound meanings, a month in which we both begin and end cycles. It lays the foundation for everything that will come, not just in December, but in the year ahead. It's not merely a reset, it's a launchpad. The seeds you plant now have the power to grow and bloom throughout the month and resonate into 2025. Imagine that every small action you take under this energy is like tossing a stone into a calm lake. The ripples created by that small movement spread far beyond the initial point. A phone call you make, a goal you write down, a habit you start. All of these create an impact that extends far beyond the present. Under the energy of this new moon, even the smallest step holds extraordinary power. But here's the crucial point. Intentions without action are like empty dreams. The universe is aligned, offering you the perfect environment to make progress. But you must do your part. Imagine this energy as a dance between you and the cosmos. It moves toward you, but expects you to take a step to meet it. Do not let the frantic pace of the month distract you. Take a moment to look inward and ask, What do I truly want? What am I willing to do to achieve it? Use this energy to plant the seeds that will transform your life, knowing that while the future is uncertain, it is shaped by the choices you make now. So chosen one, do not hesitate. Take the pen the universe is offering and start writing the story you wish to live. It doesn't have to be perfect. It only needs to be real. The magic lies in the action. And the time to act is now. It's worth remembering that this new moon is not here just to inspire dreams. It is an invitation to action. It's as if the universe is asking, what will you do now? What will be your first step? The clock has already started ticking, and this opportunity will not wait. This is the moment to rise and face this energy head on. It's not about waiting for something to happen, but about taking the initiative and showing that you are ready to embrace what is yours. This week is not just another period on the calendar. It is a unique chance to align yourself with the energy the universe offers. And here is an important truth. This week does not measure your physical strength or your ability to withstand the challenges of daily life. It measures your willingness to rise and act, even in the face of uncertainties. The energy surrounding you now is no coincidence. It is an invitation, a challenge from the universe. The question is simple yet powerful. Are you ready to answer the call? Do not let the frantic pace of the month distract you. Take a moment to look inward and ask, What do I truly want? What am I willing to do to achieve it? Use this energy to plant the seeds that will transform your life, knowing that while the future is uncertain, it is shaped by the choices you make now. So chosen one, do not hesitate. Take the pen the universe is offering and start writing the story you wish to live. It doesn't have to be perfect. It only needs to be real. The magic lies in the action. And the time to act is now. It's worth remembering that this new moon is not here just to inspire dreams. It is an invitation to action. It's as if the universe is asking, what will you do now? What will be your first step? The clock has already started ticking and this opportunity will not wait. This is the moment to rise and face this energy head on. It's not about waiting for something to happen, 
but about taking the initiative and showing that you are ready to embrace what is yours. This week is not just another period on the calendar. It is a unique chance to align yourself with the energy the universe offers. And here is an important truth. This week does not measure your physical strength or your ability to withstand the challenges of daily life. It measures your willingness to rise and act, even in the face of uncertainties. The energy surrounding you now is no coincidence. It is an invitation, a challenge from the universe. The question is simple yet powerful. Are you ready to answer the call? Reflect on the story of Moses in the book of Exodus. When God called Moses through the burning bush, he hesitated. Moses pointed out his limitations, saying he was not eloquent and didn't feel prepared to lead the people of Israel. But God reminded him, I will be with you. Exodus 3.12 Moses didn't need to have all the answers or be perfect. He simply needed to take the first step. And in doing so, he became the instrument for one of the greatest liberations in biblical history. Just like Moses, you don't need to have all the skills or understand every detail. You just need to begin. This week is asking for exactly that. A first step. Perhaps deep down, you know you've been putting something important off. Maybe it's a project, a difficult conversation, or a habit you want to change. The new moon, with its energy of renewal, is here to remind you that the time is now. It's not about achieving perfection, but about saying yes to what you know is right for you. Remember, no significant transformation happens without movement. Imagine planting a seed. At first, it may seem insignificant. You may even doubt that anything grand will come from it. But with care and attention, that small seed grows and transforms into something powerful. So it is with your initial action. However small or hesitant it may be, it has the potential to create a lasting impact. You may feel the weight of what you've been holding back, that version of yourself you know you're capable of becoming. This is the moment to let it emerge. Say goodbye to doubts and hesitation. This is not a test of skill or knowledge. It is a call to act. And the good news is, you are not alone. The energy of this new moon is like a favorable wind. It won't do the work for you, but it will make the journey smoother if you're willing to move forward. Chosen one, Stop waiting for the perfect scenario. It doesn't exist. All the universe asks is that you take a step. Whether small or large, it doesn't matter. What matters is movement. Begin now, because this moment is yours. Dreaming is not enough. You must act. Use this week to show your courage, plant your seeds, and align yourself with the purpose you know is waiting for you. The moon is watching, the universe is ready, and the choice is yours. The time to act is now. Ultimately, the meteors streaking across the sky this week are not just a visual spectacle. They represent something much greater, a call from the universe to seize the present moment. These fleeting lights are reminders that time is valuable, and opportunities are like them, brief but intense. When we look up at the sky and see a meteor, we instinctively make a wish. But why does this happen? Because deep down, we know these events carry symbolism, a call to act before it's too late. 